In this video I'm going to show you how to back up a database to a remote volume. First you go to the Exa Storage tab and select Add Remote Volume. Insert the URL of the remote location, in this case a Samba share, and give the username and password details for the connection. You can see that the remote volume now appears alongside the database volumes on the Exa Storage screen. So let's make a backup. I go back to the Exa Solution tab and click through on the database I want to back up. Under Actions, I select Backup and press Submit. I can change any of the parameters here. This time I want a full level zero backup and I want it to be available for two weeks. When I'm ready, I press Start Backup. To look at the progress of the backup, I go to the Monitoring tab and click through on the log. This shows me that the backup has already finished and there were no errors. So let's have a look at this backup. I go to the Exa Solution tab, I click through on the database and then click on Backups. This shows me the backup that has just completed. Now that I know that I have a full backup on the system, I can schedule my future backups. I do this by going to the Exa Solution tab, clicking through on my database and selecting Schedule. The scheduling screen would be familiar to anybody who's ever used CronTab, but even if you haven't, it's very straightforward. You use the asterisk as a wildcard, and what I've done here is to schedule a full level zero backup on day zero, which is every Sunday, and also an incremental backup on every day except Sunday. You can see the overall effect of doing this in the very clear diagram below.